you. So glad you're here. Welcome to my channel. Again, I'm Tara. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. Please like, subscribe, and share. And hit the notification bell so you won't miss any, any videos. So on this um, clip that I put, because I put up more than one, but on this one, I re-rolled my hair. Um, I think it was Friday ago, not too long ago, last Friday. And I wanted to have a more tighter curl because my curls were dropping really fast when I did my first um, video, which I will post so you can watch that one as well. But this time, in this um, re-rolled of the flex rods, I also added the perm rods. So I did a mixture of perm rods and flex rods. Just tried to see what it would be like. So as I was waiting to um, for them to dry, I didn't use much spray. I didn't want my blocks to be too wet. So I made sure they was, you know, damp enough to roll and then, you know, obviously use the hair dryer to dry my hair so that the curls can come out plump. And I just really couldn't wait to see what this whole thing was going to be like because I wasn't sure if the perm rods is going to take or the flex rods are going to take. So this is a new thing I was doing. So I don't know. You may want to try it to see how it goes. I just know for me, I just thought that doing this method may be different than just using all flex rods versus using all perm rods. Because I see a lot of videos of people just do perm rods or they only do flex rods. But I said, hey, I've never seen a video where people actually combine the two, the flex rods and the perm rods. Hey, you never know until you try. So I thought I'd just go ahead and give it a try. And as I was just waiting, I was like, you know what? I might as well just do a video and record myself. So I did. So now, just the next day, well, I had waited a couple of days. And then I said, okay, it's time for me to take it out. So as you can see, the curls are popping. Well, that one is popping already. So I was like, ooh, I was really excited about what it's going to be like. But listen, my arms was getting tired, okay? Not even imagining um, how you, your arms feel when you're trying to get your look. You know how us women go through all these different things trying to get us a different look? So, hey. But I'm really happy, though, about so far about how this is turning out with the flexi rods and the perm rods. Listen. Let me know what you think in the comments. And would you try mixing the two and see what happens? But I know one thing. These flexor rods, my curl was getting stuck on there, literally. So, actually, they was just... But anyway, the curl came out, and I was happy. So, I just really can't wait to see what this whole thing is going to look like. But so far, so good. As you can see, the curls are tight. And as I turn around, they filled with mixture of perm and flexi rods so hey let's see what this gonna be like what it's gonna look like but i was actually getting my hair ready because i'm going away on a trip and i'm going to paris why well, i can say bonjour moi i don't know if i'm saying that right we oui. but anyway <laughs> i'm excited about my trip and i wanted my hair to be done i wanted to have a tighter curl so i said by the time i leave and by the time i get to france i they've been to drop some so i can have a nice little you know curl drop and you know do my thing and have fun with my friend but i'm really happy about it so i packed my bag today now i'm ready to get going on my trip oh my goodness it's amazing how your arms just get so tired trying to take these things out. Not alone trying to put them in one inch by inch. And what I did with this set was that I actually did one lock at a time. I did combine some, but I didn't do as much as I did before in my last video. Where I, I um, combined maybe three or four and rolled at the same time. Sorry, at the same time. So I wanted to just try to do something different because I knew I want my curl to last a little bit longer than it did before and i actually like it tight or drop either way you know i just like the effect of it just having a different look because i always sometimes wear my lock straight so i kind of wanted to do something different with this one so as y'all can see they are popping the curls are popping 
<laughs> what y'all think about it? Look, put it in the comments. Listen, it don't look like the perm rods did. They did just as good as the flex rods. Okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> y'all see my face expressions. I'm too much. But y'all, my husband. So let me tell you something. Sleeping with these rollers ain't no joke. I could not sleep. I had the worst headache ever i said i would never be doing that again i mean you know you try to sleep for the beauty effect but listen i took these i let it stay in or i put it on friday and then i did it i had it in saturday and i took them out on sunday because i was like ain't no way i'm keeping these in another night it's no way i'm walking to my daughter's school with rollers in my hair and with the big old bonnet no that was not gonna happen you know but yeah so far so good you see the curls popping locking i'm so excited i'm really happy about this i can't wait till i dress up put my makeup put my clothes on and head out the door for my trip i'm really excited but um yeah let's see how this gonna roll roll i hope y'all like this video please subscribe share and like i really want you to do that so we can get acquainted over here in the tower goddess youtube channel <laughs> but yeah i'm excited about these curls though my goodness they really dropping like dropping like it's hot like for real but yeah i did do i didn't wash my hair again because i had washed my hair recently i just put a new color in it and i was not fit to do a whole rewash because i know my sometimes i don't know how your locks are but for my locks sometimes they take forever to dry and they can be too damp and i probably won't get the curl that i'm looking for so if you're looking for a good good curl just get your spritz bottle spray put your oils or whatever you want to put in there spray the lock the individual locks or the locks that you the, the, that you combine spray them get them a nice little coat of wetness and then roll roll and roll till your arms can't roll no more but y'all see these curls though do you see the curls listen this mixture of perm rods and flexi rods are is dope i'm definitely doing it again I don't know when because my arms get too tired, but I'm definitely going to do this transition again and post a video for you guys because I'm trying to do more blogging and stuff. But I really do like and do more with my hair. I don't know if I'm going to pin it up or something like that, but so far I just didn't had it down since I have took out my rods. But the transition to doing all of this was whew, it's a lot of work. Definitely took time. My husband came down and said, you're not done rolling your hair yet. But yeah. I finally got it done. Y'all see the back? It's rolling in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting close to, well, a little bit close to almost getting it done. But I used a, a, some medium-sized one because I was running out of the other size I was trying to use. I was trying not to let them be so big this time. So I did. But the, look at the curl, though. Yeah. Yeah, I'm excited about that curl. Nothing like a nice curl. Something got stuck. What's that? Lint? Some type of lint. No, is that? I think that's one of the rod pieces that got stuck in my hair. Y'all see that? <laughs> it was. Look at that. <laughs> it literally got stuck in my hair because I pulled out the flexi rod so tight. And look, the whole thing like it came apart. Uh, but I got enough of them. The whole wire is out. <laughs> oh my gosh. It was doing the most. It got stuck. Oh well. It is what it is. But yeah. I'm really happy about that. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Pull them rods out, honey. They get stuck on there. Yeah. So, but I like watching other people's videos. And, you know, seeing their process of how they do things with their locks, you know. Because having locks is everything. I must admit, when I first started my lock journey, I wasn't patient. But having locks has taught me so much patience. Okay? So, keep going. Keep pushing your lock journey. Take care of your hair. Wash it. Condition it. Do what you got to do. But, y'all, this process listen it is going and going 
But yeah, one thing I must admit, the flexi rods was kind of hard to get out, but the perm rods kind of slid right off. I really didn't have an issue with it, which is a good thing. So I was really happy about that process. But as y'all y'all see these flexi rods be doing the most? <laughs> oh my goodness, look at it. Mmm. Coming out better than I thought. Definitely better than last time. I'm going to link my other video. So y'all can see. Um, the process of how that. Um, how that one was. That video that I will link. Is the one I did with all flexi rods. It was no perm rods in my last video. So I really want you to see that one. To see the difference between mixing the two. The perms and the flexi rods. <clears throat> Ooh, something going on with my throat. Sorry. But, um, yeah, it was late, so I didn't want to be talking in a video while my children sleeping. So I said I'd do a little voiceover for you guys so y'all can hear what I was thinking during the whole process. But, yeah, but I definitely like a curly suit. <laughs> mm -hmm. I was getting tired even then. But, you know, we got to keep pushing for the beauty. I know one thing, I slept good when I took these things out my head the next night. And one thing I love is that when I put my bonnet on, the curls are still there. They are not going away. They just, I'm like, wow, I'm able to sleep and still take off my bonnet. And I got my curls, honey. So, yeah. Yeah. So, I'm really happy about that. So, don't be afraid to put your bonnet on at night. Put it on and get going. So I'm going to turn around so y'all can see how I'm taking them out in the back and how it's turning out so far, so far, so good. I wanted y'all to see up and close and personal what that was like. But yeah, I'm really excited about that. I'm just throwing them now, just throwing them to the side. <laughs> look, I'm, I was, look, I got to the point where I was over it. It's like, I'm so over this right now. I should have had, if my daughter was in sleep, I would have had her take them out. Well, she would have been yaking on my head. So, I'm like, listen. <clears throat> but I'm nearly to the end. So, y'all can see the whole process of what it looked like. <clears throat> because, yes, I just, I was a little nervous at first to see the mixture of perm rods and flexi rods. But, listen, it did the job. So, I was really happy about that. <clears throat> so, Y'all see how easy it is to take the perm rods out versus you can literally just slide the curl off the um perm rods versus the flexi rod. Look at the hard time I'm having taking this thing out. Like, really? Come off already. <laughs> it took like it was gonna Y'all see this? <laughs> the whole thing was just like boom, but look at that curl. Where are we at? Oh, excuse me. Jeez, this sparkling water ain't no joke. <clears throat> but, yeah. Look at this curl. Come on, Flexi. They came out pretty easy. Yeah. But I know my head was sore. A little bit more to go. Y'all like my color? Let me know if you like my color. I had blonde before. But I figure I need some change. Springtime. I need a different look, a different color, you know. So, oh, it's almost there. I can't wait to see what this full thing gonna look like. Come on, Flexi. See how easy that is. <laughs> that one's being a little bit stubborn, but yeah. Flex around all twist and turn. I was trying to slide it off, but it just would not budge off the dog or flex it. But oh, look, look at that. That one did pretty good, actually, considering all the other ones that I had. <laughs> so, come on now. Y'all see my arms and tired. I definitely went to bed after this. I was like, listen, no more. 
No more, no more. Come on, Flexi Rock. Get in there, get in there. I would say the whole process is definitely something you have to say. I mentally had to prepare myself to roll my hair. It's not something that you just, oh, I'm roll my hair, you know, for fun. Mm-hmm. I mentally had to prepare myself to roll my hair and take it down because I know it takes time. <clears throat> but, hey, as I said before, having locks definitely give you patience. Because you go through the ugly stages of locks and you have your good days and your bad days. But I must admit, every day with my locks, I find it's a good day. Because it's easy for me having three children, having to get up, having to deal with my hair. I can just spray my hair, wash it, make sure it's clean, my scalp clean, condition my locks. And if I want to style it, I style it. And if I want to put a ponytail, I put a ponytail. Whatever I want to do, I don't have to do much to my hair, which helps for me having three children. Ooh, sorry, I'm tired. Ooh. But, um... Yeah, I'm really excited about this. If you want to lock up, I say go for it, okay? So, nearly done there. Almost at the end of this video. And if you're still hanging in there with me, that means you have enjoyed this video. So, please subscribe, like, and share. And come back for more content because I'll be making more. And I'm, I am I am going to document my trip to France. So, hey, come along with me on that one. And yeah, let's see how it all rolls with my curls, curls and furrows. <laughs> but yeah, <clears throat> come on now. See, you have to go all the way with this one. It's doing too much. I'm trying not to tear up all my flexi rods. So I didn't tore up a couple of them trying to pull my hair off because I was trying not to go all the way out because I hate trying to reset the curl again. But it is what it is. Almost done. Almost at the end. Almost at the end. Almost at the end. Oh, I was so happy when I got these things up out of my head. Oh, my word. I think I bent the rods too much. Well, they wasn't. I had to try to straighten it to get it out. Look at that. <laughs> I'm struggling. I am struggling on this oh. one. Oh man, I'm busted. I am totally busted. It's crickets, 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 crickets. <laughs> but yeah, back to it. Let's go, let's go. Things that we do for beauty. Am I almost done? Jeez, I got a big head. <laughs> I said it, I know. <clears throat> Ooh, I think I had put some of them too tight. It was really hurting. Jeez, think it's stuck. Big curls don't care. <clears throat> the base is just kind of showing you how to take out the flexor rod. I didn't always try to roll my curl all the way out. I got to do better. Some of them you can take out, pull out, and some of them you have to really kind of roll out to get the curl out. Yeah, now. Yeah, nearly there to the end. Come on now. Let's get this flexor rod out of there. <clears throat> Curl, look at that. All right now. When you're tired, like me. Ooh. You see my eyes? Listen, I was so happy when it was over. I hope y'all enjoyed this video as I said before 
yeah, I, I try not to put, I spray just a little bit of spray on my locks, even though they curl now. Because I'm like, I don't want them to drop too fast, but fast, but not too fast. Anyway, that makes sense. So, yeah, nearly there. It's like, how many more left? My gosh. I definitely have to pick up filling and make sure I got it all out. <clears throat> I literally threw the flexor rod. I was so over it at this point. Literally over it. <laughs> I got to do better. I definitely got to do better. Oh. <laughs> the struggle is real. Girls, pop a lock, you guys. Come on now. Pull it through. I try not to put too much tension on my scalp as I was rolling these things up. Because, ugh. That's mainly because I'm tender-headed. Very, very tender-headed. And sleeping with these things, like... It was, it was crazy. It was mad. Completely mad. Mm -mm. Come on now. That one just stubborn. Stubborn, stubborn, stubborn. Pull off, Lexi. <laughs> I must admit, the perm rods are easier to take out versus the flexor rods, but that's just my opinion. Somebody else can think differently, but that's me and I'm sticking to it. Y'all hanging in there with me. All right, I see you, I see you. As you see, my hands are a little oily because I did, like I do put vitamin E oil in my head and lemongrass on my scalp just to rub it through. The lemongrass have a beautiful smell. I got a hole in the middle of my head right there. I gotta see how I'm gonna fix that. But y'all, yeah. <laughs> I think as the locks get older, they'll, I can separate some and they'll be all, they'll be all good. <gasps> Jesus. Mm. I am done. Y'all see the full process of this? All the locks, sorry, all of the rollers are out. The flexi and the I got a phone call. Don't you hate when that happens when you're trying to do a voiceover? Anyway, all the curls are pop a locking, guys. Y'all like it? 
I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I am loving my hair right now. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look how full it is and bouncy. Oh, and look at the color. It's coming. It seems like the older the color is getting, it's just, oh, it's winning me. It's winning me over. I used the copper and a, I think I remember what the other one was, but I did a mixture of copper and something. Even though my hair was already blonde, but good night. Good night. I'm tired. Look how happy I am to put my bunny on with no rollers. Look at God. <laughs> but yeah. Thank you guys for watching my video. Please like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. See y'all. See y'all. See y'all. Y'all see that? Mm -mm. All right. See y'all in my next video. I'm all curls and no whirls. <laughs>